The Sultan of Sokoto, Al Haji Saad Abu Bakr III, has urged President Muhammad Buhari and all governors in the country to ensure justice for all Nigerians. The Sultan, who is also the President General, Nigerian Supreme Council for Islamic Affairs, gave the advice at the emergency meeting of the Executive Council of the National Council of Traditional Rulers of Nigeria held in Abuja. Let's convey our greetings to Mr. President. We are always ready to work to make this country a better place where peace and justice reign. Justice. Justice. I'm repeating justice because of the importance of justice in any developing society, in any developed society, in any community, in any leadership position, there must be justice in whatever a leader is doing, even in your own homes. But it's important to emphasize this justice issue. But if you see problems cropping up everywhere, there's a problem with justice. And that's why you don't have very good solutions. Because so we know, yes, rightly, as Lamfordio said, he said, a nation can endure with unbelief, but it cannot endure with injustice. So justice is the foundation of any nation. We are going to be very, very blunt, very open, and very frank in our discussions on all issues affecting this country. The army of Ife, Oba Adeyeye Enitan Ogunsi, Ojaja II, also urged the federal government to create initiatives that will bring government closer to the people with a view to help traditional, to help traditional institutions. I want to implore the SGF for the SGF to feedback everybody in government that it's not only about when we're doing politics or when time is very close to election that you should be very close to people. You should come up with a program and, or initiative that from time to time we should devise the means of getting close to our people in order to support we the traditional rulers. It's very important for that gap to be bridged so that issues that we experienced in Nigeria recently will not reoccur. It's a lesson for each and every one of us and we all must work towards how to better the lot of our youths in this country. For his part, Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Mr. Boss Mustafa, has this to say. I therefore urge you to include as part of your agenda for this meeting discussions on the various challenges facing our nation and in particular generate ideas and solutions to the consequences and lessons from the recent protests by the Nigerian youth. As custodians of our culture and tradition, you are the closest to the people at the grassroots and your recommendations, I'm sure, will reflect the true desires and aspirations of majority of Nigerians. Oba Frederick and Italorunda, the Olubo of Igbo land, expressed delight with the meeting of the Executive Committee of the National Council of Traditional Rulers of Nigeria, saying they were given the opportunity to talk. I was uh, extremely happy because they give us a window to talk. Everybody expresses his mind. We look at what happened, the totality of what happened in the country. And uh, some of us were embarrassed because uh, the monarch is supposed to stop what happened. Why we cannot stop it, we discuss it today because we don't have constitutional rule. News agency of Nigeria reports that the emergency meeting was necessitated by the unrest in some parts of the country arising from the NSAS protest, which was hijacked by hoodlums.